Hi lovelies, welcome back to Amy's Kitchen. I'm back again with another delicious recipe. This is called Giza Dodo. It's a blend of Giza Dodo and uh, tomato sauce. Stay tuned. These are the ingredients we are going to be using. You can see we have some garlic, ginger, hot pepper, bell pepper, we have the red, yellow and the green. We have some tomatoes onion thyme garlic ginger paprika pepper thin tomatoes some maggi cube crayfish and uh, our plantain so this is our gizzard already washed when washing you want to make sure you take out the gizzard lining and uh, this is chicken gizzard you can find it in any local grocery store you have around you i'll start by boiling the gizzard uh, for the seasoning i'll be using some thyme ginger, garlic, paprika, maggi cube, water and some salt. After adding in our water and seasoning, I'll cover the pan and let the gizzard boil for about 30 minutes or until when tender. You can also cut the gizzards into bites to ease the chewing process. While the gizzard is boiling, I'll begin prepping our ingredients. I'll start by cutting the, uh, the onion, sorry. And please take note, all the ingredients used will be listed in the description box below. So if you miss anything, you can always go back to the description box to get it. So what I'm basically doing here is chopping the tomatoes and onion into a separate bowl and for the bell peppers and the spring onion they are also going to go into a separate bowl together as you're watching this video please do not forget to like share subscribe and also leave your comments below Now we'll move into our blended ingredients. This is basil and parsley, and ginger, garlic, and some hot pepper. You can always adjust the hot pepper to suit your tolerance. I'll add in a little bit of water to this and blend it into a paste. Next, we'll move into our plantains. We'll peel the plantains and dice them. So after peeling, we separate the plantain into two, two halves and another two halves, then we dice them. Easy. That's the shape we are looking for.
this is after 30 minutes our gizzard is ready we are gonna separate the gizzard from the stock right now now we'll add in some oil into the pan to fry the gizzard we are not going to be frying the gizzard for too long because when you do that it becomes bouncy This is the stage you want to take out the gizzard because you don't want to fry it golden brown. Like I said, it becomes um, bouncy and hard to chew. Next, I'm moving to prepare our sauce. So add in some oil and let it heat up. And this is my oil to fry the plantain also. Um, you can use any oil of your choice. I'm just gonna put it in and let the plantain fry golden until golden brown. While waiting for our plantains to get ready, we'll move into our sauce. First thing you always want to fry your onion for at least 30 seconds before you put in your tomatoes. This helps to give it an extra flavor. After frying our tomatoes for at least two minutes, we'll add in our tin tomatoes and continue frying. Our tomato is now ready, we'll add in our blended ingredients and let it fry for at least one minute again. I'll add in one stock cube um, and some salt and mix it up. It's time to add in my crayfish and a little bit of water. I don't like my gizzard dodo dry. I like it moist. So I'm going to add in a little bit of water. I'm not using the stock because I don't like using the stock of any internal organ. That's just me. That's just me. There's nothing wrong with it. If you want to use it, you can use it. I'm going to add, and add the gizzard and let it boil for one minute just so it can soak into the sauce. Our plantain is now ready. You can see it's golden brown. You can also use an air fryer for a healthier choice. It's time to add in our plantain into the sauce and gizzard. Mix it up to make sure it's well combined. Look how juicy it's looking. Oh my my. I can't wait to have some of this. So the last stitch is just to add in our um, peppers and the green onion. Mix it all together to make sure it's well combined and voila our gizzard dodo is ready thank you all for watching this video please do not forget to like share subscribe and also leave your comments below if you're new to this channel i say welcome to you please do not forget to subscribe if you're an old sobby i say thank you for always trusting and coming back to watch my videos
Have a good day. Bye-bye.